that dark. By the way, that stick's coming back. Information Romeo, Mercer departure. 105 Mike Mike, ground Romeo 31 right taxi via Alpha. 31 right via Alpha, 5 Mike Mike. Okay, we're clear left and right. Okay, canopy secure, trim set, fuel's on the wings, controls are free and correct. Temps are up, here comes the runner. Doesn't take much. Okay, so let's do a gentle left turn back toward Mount Rainier. Look for traffic and start. You can start bringing the nose up to slow down. Hold the nose up there. Trying not to climb here. Yeah, you can climb. No, you can climb. I just want to bleed off the energy. Once you're aiming at Mount Rainier, you can roll wings level. We'll do the first one just wings level stall. Okay, so go ahead and smoothly bring the stick back, and I'll, and I'll help you establish the proper pitch attitude. So right about in there is good. Just You're going to gradually increase the pitch attitude as we slow down. You're looking out at your wings. When you feel the buffet, no power, just relax the back stick and, and uh, let the airplane fly again. A little bit more right rudder. There you go. And just hold this pitch attitude now. Don't keep bringing it back anymore. There we go. Do you feel that buffet? But you see the airplane doesn't really do much. Go ahead and pull it back up into another one. Nice and smooth there. Just hold it right about there. We'll buff it again. So it's very, it talks to you. Okay, so now roll us into a left turn, maybe 30 degrees of bank, and we're going to do the same thing. Bring the nose up into a stall. We're not going to, we're going to just hold the, maintain the bank angle. Bring the stick back a little bit more. There you go. Back right back up into another one. There you go. Be easy now. Here, let me take the airplane for just a second. I'll show you what I'm talking about. We just roll it into this bank. Just let the let the airplane stall and we just now we just relax it, bring it back up. We hold the bank angle pretty much constant. We can fly it around like this all day. So that you can see that the wing doesn't know where the horizon is, it just knows angle of attack. Bring the car back in, we'll climb up a little bit. Incredibly sharp stall buffet. Yeah, it, it talks to you. 
Okay, we're back up. We've got enough altitude. Why don't you try another one of those? This time to the right. So power's coming back. Roll us into that right turn. Hold the nose up. That's the combat. There you go. Easy now. Not so much. You don't need to. Just ease forward on the stick and the roll will stop. Bring it on back. There you go. Try it again. Bring it back, back up. Excellent. You can see you just really need to ease off. It comes right. It starts climbing. Okay, roll wings level. Good. Power is coming in. We'll climb back up a little bit. How you doing? Doing okay. All right. Just okay or good? Yeah, uh, okay. <laughs> All right. Do you need a break? Uh, just give me uh, 30 seconds. All right. You, you've got the airplane. Just fly us along here. We'll go ahead and climb back up a little bit. We're only at 35, so we'll get a little more altitude back. Yeah, I'll take the controls. I'm going to show you a nice, easy aileron roll just so you get a feel for what that's like, okay? I'll talk you through it. We're going to do this first one to the left. We only need about 120 knots to do easy rolls. So, so we start out from a level position. I raise the nose, look out at the wingtips just briefly. Now look straight ahead. Neutral elevator, and I move the stick about a quarter to a third of the way to the left, and around we go. <laughs> Wings level, I bring the nose back up to the horizon. You don't need very much rudder, if, if any, on a turn, on a roll to the left in this airplane. You've got the controls. Okay. Got plenty of speed, so just raise the nose, look out at your wingtips, make sure you get about 15, 20 degrees. Look straight ahead when you're rolling, look straight ahead. Neutral elevator. There you go. All the way back around. Good. How you doing? That worked okay. Alright, we'll try try one to the right this time. Just nice and easy. Raise the nose. Neutralize the elevator first. Now stick over. Hold your head straight and level. Let the airplane come around. Good. You need a little bit of rudder on the right ones. Okay. Now, I can either show you a loop at this point to give you some G-awareness, or we can start off with an incipient spin. What would you like to do? Well, let's try, let's try the uh, spin. Okay. So I'll demo one for you. I've got the airplane. Got plenty of altitude. What I'm going to do is I'm going to bring the power back a bit to simulate that we're kind of in the traffic pattern here. We're clear to the left. I'm going to start a left turn just like we were in a making the turn in the traffic pattern. And now look out straight ahead over the nose of the airplane. As I bring the stick back, I'm going to add too much left rudder. The nose accelerates ahead of the turn, and when we spin, we end up in a, it snaps right over on its back, right? Yeah. And to recover from that, all you really want to do is release that back pressure, Break the stall, and then uh, find the horizon, roll uh, wings level, and then recover the airplane. Okay, we're back through 6,000. Keep the turn coming. I'm going to bring the power back now. Okay, now start adding right rudder and bring the stick back. And let it come around. Let it come around. There you go. Now, release forward stick. We're flying again. Bring the nose up. Nice and smooth. Excellent. All the way back up, and then we add power. How you doing? I'm doing okay, but try and get used to that sensation. It's a little bit weird. Let's do a right turn toward Mount Rainier. Spiral dive. You don't want to pull until you've got the wings level, right? Right. Okay. Try another one. To the left again. I'm just going to take a break here. Okay, take a break. Okay, I'll bring the power back a little bit. Save some gas. How you doing? Doing okay. I need to kind of uh, stabilize the gyros here. All right. Just fly along here for a minute, then you can make a turn back to the north when you're ready. Look around for traffic, enjoy the view of all these gorgeous mountains. Really different sensation from just kind of normal straight and level banking around. It is, that's right. Okay, let's make a right-hand turn back towards uh, Mount Baker there. On a little bit, I can feel my uh, my head sweating a little bit, okay. which is not a great sign. No, no. So do you want to try a loop, or do you want to do some more of those stalls, or do you want to do some more rolls, or what would you like to do? Let's try a loop. 
Okay, I'll demo the loop for you. I've got the airplane. Need a little more speed for this. I'll talk you through it and just look where I tell you to look when I tell you to look, okay? We need about 140 knots. We start all the maneuvers from straight and level. We're 5,500, we're clear above. So it's a straight ahead pull. We're looking for about three and a half to four Gs. Checking our wingtips. Now we're looking straight back toward the tail. There's Mount Rainier coming into view. We relax the pit, the pole as we come over the top. And then as we start down the backside, we're adding pole. Nice, smooth, steady pole. You're gonna feel a little G. And right back where we started. Okay, I'll take it back. Good, I got the airplane. The airplane. Boeing Tower, extra 105, Mike Mike, Bellevue information, Sierra, landing. Extra 105, Mike Mike, Boeing Tower, right traffic, runway 3 and right, report Seward Park. Report Seward Park, right traffic, 3 one right, 5 Mike Mike. Boeing Tower, extra 5, Mike Mike, Seward Park. Extra 5, Mike Mike, runway 3 one right, clear to land, 1-0-1-0-5. Clear to land, 3 one right, 5 Mike Mike. Landing procedure's a little bit unusual, too. Start up from here from the perch on um, downwind and opposite the touchdown point will reduce power almost to idle and start a turn almost immediately. That way I can see the runway and make a nice steep approach. Power coming back. Prop is forward. We're in the turn. 90 knots. Nobody on final. Runway's made, power to idle. Flip, little slip. That went on. <laughs> that wasn't too bad. That wasn't good. But it stops flying, it stops flying. <laughs> Extra five mic turn right at the end, then cut a ground. One nine or up here on my mic. Five mic mic.